Hello. It's been a couple of interesting episodes. We, um, we went to Einraj a couple of episodes ago, and then we, um, rang with, uh, Einraj so we could synchronize something, something, and then we were able to find the, uh, Chav of the Tree of Life, which we did. And, um, we're going to be able to power the golem with this method, um, but it means that we have to travel to the very base of Einraj. Uh, so here we go. We're doing it. I do, I think we have to travel like 30 strata deep. This is going to be a lot. But hopefully it won't be too much. I love, love, love the tile set for these weird roots, these crystal roots. They read like so exactly correctly. Like it's hard for me to even describe. I just love them so much. Um, but yeah, I mean, this is a very bizarre quotation marks dungeon. I haven't really done it before. Um, but you can kind of like leap down floor by floor. Um, one of my like favorite stories slash comics of all time is a comic called Zot. Uh oh, I don't know what that is, but I don't want to find out. Something is trying to uh, shoot at us. Is that? Oh, that was a uh, dream crungle. I'm a little worried that that uh, rocket <laughs> turret to our east is going to try and shoot the dream crungle while I'm standing next to it. Looks like they didn't. Looks like they thought better of it. There's another dream crungle over to our west. Um, anyway, there's this, a comic called Zot, and one of my favorite runs in, in Zot is one where uh, Zot, by the way, is a very strange superhero, quotation marks, sort of. Um, but they exist in a weird pocket dimension sort of retro futurist like universe it's, it's very very strange um but it's it's one of my favorites oh it looks like uh that dromad caravan is fighting a mecha they're engaged all right well let's uh let's help them out anyway um in one run, Zot has to go and disarm a bomb, which has apparently been like planted in um, the like bottom of this weird skyscraper, and he has to like run down like several hundred flights of stairs, um, and there are like little brief windows where he gets to uh, kind of fly. He can literally fly, so when I say fly, I mean literally, but. Um, you know, literally fly down several flights outside of the building, but then there are moments where he has to, like, get back in the building and then, um, continue going down the staircase. It's, it's a very strange and interesting comic, and I love that run because it's just so bizarre. Um, this quest really reminds me of it because it's very similar, uh, in in that you have to like go down these staircases but then you can like you get moments where you can just like jump down all of these little crevices i seem to recall things get like they progress as you go down and it's kind of like a reflection of the actual world like right now we're just in our normal kind of caves but uh, going deep enough, you eventually encounter like different dungeons, different places that you've known. Oh no. Okay, so we have a, uh oh, okay. They, they know where we are, but we don't know where they are. Oh, there they are. We're gonna sunder their mind. It's another gel. Does the gel seem particularly susceptible to sunder mind? Oh, we are dil dilute and entropic again. I wonder if we're still metabolizing that one meal. We are. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, control F. -la. We don't have a lot of fresh water left. 
unfortunately, um, dilute entropic counts as a negative status effect. So, um, we can we can do this to no longer become entropic. If you don't know uh, becoming entropic, um, I believe it can shuffle your entire build. <laughs> like I think it's is as bad as that. Um, but I might be wrong. I might be confusing that with uh, drinking warm static, which I believe um, gives you some extra points to spend, but also shuffles your build. So anyway, I don't want my build to be shuffled. I'm very, very happy with my build. That is one thing that would like 100% ruin everything if, uh, you know, can we, can we get the 25% please? We're still dilute entropic. Uh, I really need to get the mushroom version of this um, recipe. It's, it turns out. G. Whoops. No. Oh, did we do it? I think we did it. Get out of here. Stupid hermit. Um, we're not on good terms with beetles. That's fine. I'll just destroy your nest. It's been a while since I've heard this, uh, theme. I'm gonna go ahead and reserve our... I, I actually, I think that this is a staircase zone. Yep. I'm gonna reserve our, uh clairvoyance for if we see a psychic presence or you know, extra dimensional presence we're just jumping down several flights of stairs we're at 20 strata this is going pretty quickly no i don't want to jump down i do appreciate that it warns you okay i think we have a new soundtrack Maybe it's just some new ambient sounds. Vast animus. Easy peasy, just a vast animus. Uh, what is... What is rippling out there? That's a weird one. Okay, they're dead. What is happening? It's like a mushroom is like got some uh, temporal dilation going on. The mushroom is dead. There's a greater voider. They're covered. I don't know. There's some kind of kerfuffle going on. There's some uh, garbage. I wouldn't mind grabbing the garbage real quick. Uh, except I guess I can't because there's tabbies on the screen, so I'm, I'm not going to bother. Looks like an awfully long fall. Are you sure you want to jump? No. What about here? Okay, here we go. We got an ogre pelt. I'll, I'll pick up an ogre pelt. Ooh, we've got a splatter. Was there anything on the splatter? Time begins to distort. We've got interesting things going on, like time dil dilation creatures and critters. Okay, we are 31 strata deep. I might have been, I might have underestimated how deep we have to go. It might, oh, psychic presence. Here we go. Where are they? Oh, don't tell me they're the astral tabby. They are the astral tabby. Uh, they're phased. I don't think I can sunder the mind of someone who's phased, right? Oh, no, we totally can. But that might be the only thing I can do to them. Although they didn't seem to have very much health. So, uh, easy, easier uh, dimensional creature that I've had to fight. If something ends up killing us, it will be an extra dimensional creature, by the way. No, no doubt in my mind. 
that or I accidentally uh, do something dumb. I don't know. Like anger a chrome pyramid. There's a chance. Okay, ooh. Something is burgeoning. It seems we are fighting some kind of saps. Vigor saps. They're worth some XP. I'll definitely uh, kill them. Gosh. Oh, we got mirror bugs. Uh, that was a big explosion just now. Don't really want to fight mirror bugs, as previously mentioned. Um, we're on good terms with the lava gels, thankfully. Is a, there? There's so there, there's a mirror over here. I really want to deal with this right now. Oh God! Look at all the mirror bugs. Don't really want to fight. Don't really want to fight the mirror bugs. There's not much reason for me to do that, to be honest. Luckily, we have all the move speed in the world, and we can just kind of walk away. Let's have a look at this zone. Okay, we got gamma moths. We're descending quite quickly. Oh, we have cherubs. We have cherubs that don't like us. We also have a Pewtis Templar over there. Grand New Father. I don't think I've seen that one before. Kind of wouldn't mind uh, hanging out here, to be honest. Let's see if we can um, sunder the mind of a cherub. Yeah, we can. Domesticated electric worm cherub. That'll be a nice chunk of damage when they, uh... Oh, I think they already exploded, as it were. Oh, that's right. Don't, don't ever shoot a cherub. No point. I think we're on good terms with one of those cherubs. I think maybe the dog. There's a lot of things going on over there. Oh my goodness. Uh, looks like both cherubs just ate it. Well, kind of sucks, honestly. I wouldn't mind checking out the, um, Dromad. We seem to be on okay terms with everyone else on this, uh, screen, so... Including the flowers. What do you got? You got some metamorphic polygel. Oh, I will always buy metamorphic polygel. To my own detriment, I will likely do that. What do we got? Oh, we got a bunch of floating glow spheres. We can offload all those. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. We do have a light rail. I could, oh, the light rail is actually a bit too expensive to sell. We do have a lot of gems. Oh, let's sell this ogre ape pelt. Perfect. Okay, that was a nice little pit stop. Let, let us continue. Um, Clairvoyance is back. We have... Oh, no, there there's the uh, cherub, actually. Let's uh, continue hitting that worm cherub. I think if you move at all, um, you basically lose your connection but that's fine like i say we have tons of move speed oh we got a flawless crystal dagger over there that's some nice goods i just i want to kill this worm because like this is you know it's xp badly wounded badly wounded dead that's a thousand xp um what about this other one mechanical electric dog cherub i think electric means that they will not take they will not get hit by uh, Sundermind. But it doesn't seem to say that they uh, reflect damage, so we could try just shooting them. Oh, they are, uh, we're on good terms with them. Do I really want to shoot them? I guess I do. Okay, um... 
reflects yeah okay so they they reflect damage as well doesn't that suck all right let's just leave there we go go to the bottom of taproot um we've got a whoa we have a lot of things going on here aog aoig aoig no longer servant of toe and the cosmic wood loved by the secrets of the sightless way disliked by goat folk well still um it would be kind of cool to make friends with him the utensil arrives you to prune the fate rhizome and free our girl go now and perform the motion you're a seeker of the sightless way utensil that is my avocation yes a million sun dead homes i've roved a trillion more await i'm a worm in the loam of a cosmic wood perched on a cosmic gulf swathed in the god manifold where are you seeking tau prune the utensil prunes but no the utensil quivers in uncertainty and vibrates out of question the self is riddled with category errors the thinking brain mistakes formation for meaning tell me i wish to understand maggot what do you think words are arrows of inquiry words are bricks each spoken is laid in bond and builds your prison there is no understanding bricks can be thrown too <laughs> You tarry on the future's boundary with abandoned utensil. Throw your brick if you dare. Eh, uh, let's make friends. Um, yeah. Negative 85. They would teach us temporal fugue. Well, that would actually solve a couple of problems, to be honest. That would be really nice. Um, it would mean I don't have to have that mask anymore. Very tempting, but uh, I would need to gain about 300 reputation with um, Servants of the uh, Sightless Way. Which... Hmm. 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 Yes. Maybe this is a good moment to do this. Um. Let us use a metamorphic polygel on our let's see here miscellaneous schrodinger page of from the annuls uh of cud chapter unspecified morphs into another perfect i just wanted to know if that worked and it did work and now we can use one so let's go ahead and entangle then let's choose Seekers of the Sightless Way. Imagine, like, this guy... This guy is standing in front of me and says some, like, cryptic stuff, right? And then, and then they're like, oh, I see. I, I now remember that you're actually, like, uh, you know, a big deal. On the 20th of Ayurut, Nimashram became admired by the Seekers of the Sightless Way for sharing fresh water with them. But we're going to need another one of those. 200 is not enough. We need a second one. Indeed, we need a second. So, uh, I will apply a second metamorphic polygel. And the only thing that gates us with um, metamorphic polygels, like, they are expensive. But at a certain point, we basically have as many as we can buy, right? So let's just go ahead and make another one and then use it. Yes, I am doing this for Temporal Fugue, by the way. Although, do I really need Temporal Fugue? I haven't really used it in a while. Hmm. Maybe I don't really need this anymore. I think the thing that I like about it is that it's also the plus one ego, but there's other ways to get that. If he if he gave um whatchamacallit uh precognition, this would be a no-brainer. That would have been so nice. But um 
Yeah, maybe I don't need Temporal Fugue and I'll eventually just get rid of uh, this face uh, item anyway. But hey, what do we have here at our uh, Dromad? Not much. Sleep beard gland paste. Yeah, there's really not a lot going on. There's a pistol, but can't imagine it being anything I want. All right, let's talk to the glowing soft. Touch Tao's chime to soft thing. Complete quest step. Oh no. Oh no. It's not working. <laughs> Oh no, it's, it's bugged. Oh, uh, I had this problem before, uh, but with, um, with Gritgate's quest. Well, okay, something I could do, um, there is a, there is a way around this. Uh, just give me one second. Okay, um, I might actually be completely wrong. Uh, I looked at my quest steps. And it turns out that I don't actually have Tao's Chime. I, I think I did exactly the same thing uh, that me and Narf did in our series where I got the quest, but I didn't actually get the Chime. So um, what I'm going to do is, you know, um, it's it, it becoming a theme. We're going to go ahead and put a nuclear cell in this programmable recoiler and imprint it so that I have one right in front of the soft Chime. And then we're going to recoil to um moon stair i'm hoping it'll still be at chava the tree of life and it is very good so now we'll go um talk to tau where are they tamas that's none of that is right um current location I think I have to be here right where's Tao where are they <laughs> um hmm Tikva? It's not Tikva, right? I am to carry Tao's chime to Taproot so she can leave Java. It begs, speak not of Tao. She shone so bright with none of the heat from my blank from Zedek. To remember her departure harms it. This and Gaia Dream are too much for it to bear. Your Zedek? No, it cannot. It cannot. It cannot. It misses it. It misses it. Look into the light. It burns away the sorrow. It burns away. Please. Were you affected by a Gaia dream? It can scarce find the dream in this light. It thinks of Tezek or Zedek and weeps. It was not here. Not last time. Uh, last time the static light or static was in high pitch, but it remembers the pain and fear. It is not ready to feel these. It cannot gaze into the, its light light and speak not of nightmares zedek okay where is tau i'm a little bit confused about this is it still crystal chime or is it the blank or is it tamas um might be Tama's. I am to carry Tao's chime to Taproot so she can leave Chava. Right, she and sang to the spark in Tama's too. By her and through her, one could well night feel full and at crown's end. She returns to soft now, yes, and then to walk free as else. See, see her there for me. Um, I might actually have to look up here how, how this works i'm afraid i'm a little bit lost um retrieve retrieve tao's chime from her branch in keter 
Tao's Chime. The Still Crystal Chime is a quest item and piece of body armor found at the top of Chava that must be delivered to Tao during the quest. Still Crystal Chime. Um, is it the still crystal chime itself? Do I collect this? Oh yeah, okay. That's what we do. All right, I I've done it. And now we recoil back to 40 strata deep in the crystalline roots and we touch soft soft chime you have finished the step reunite tau with her chime if the of the quest if then else 5000 xp which is nice again i perceive thank you root climber chava's rewards are great and you are deserving of them how are you feeling Present, alone, afraid, but anticipating my return to the embrace of a collective. It seems that someone is waiting for you. More than someone, my liaison is the extended, outstretched hands of a greater mind ha a haven than I have otherwise known. I might not have had the courage to else without knowing that a collective awaited me. My future is hazy, my future is bright. You would suborn your will to tow? Speaking creatures seem very engrossed in this will idea, but few agree what it is. Your mind is under influence from other think beings the moment you observe them, yes? You learn by imitating. Your values and beliefs are adopted from observation, yes? I have made a choice to offer my consciousness to a new paradigm, but this choice seems distinct from your conception of will. We speak past one another. The Seekers of the Sightless Way hunt espers. Oh, yes, I see. Well, do you not hunt or align with hunters? You seek of predation yourself. You kill, yes? I recall no promise to become a grazing hedonist. If I am called to hunt, I will hunt. May the fates favor you, Tao no longer. I wish the same for you, Nimashram. Before you go, take this, a piece of my body stuff, as thanks for completing the Elsling. Then live and drink. Crystalline Halo. I believe it is a ha hat. It would go on the head. Or the arm? I guess I can wear it. It does what? Plus one ego, grants you telepathy, grants you quicken mind, refresh a random cooldown on use. Interesting and potentially very helpful, but I, I don't think I can use this. I mean, I suppose I could, but like the Psychodyne helmet is two AV plus four willpower. It almost does the same thing, but better because the extra willpower just reduces all cooldowns. Um, and then, you know, the extra intelligence is nice too, though not incredibly helpful. If this offered, I guess it offers two AV. There's something here. Plus one ego. Telepathy is actually worthless because I get it from Kesselface. Uh, it's, it's interesting. I don't know if I'll be, end up using it. It's a, a bit of a shame about this temporal fugue, but there may be other uh, legendary seekers of the sightless way that I could potentially um, learn from. Is there anything else here? Nope. That is it. Okay, so then we will travel again back to Moonstair. And fortunately, it hit, this place has not moved yet. This this place is kind of like the lost island as it, it moves around, so... Um, we'll travel up and we will talk to Divrick. Divrak. I've reunited Tao with her chime. So you have. And what proceeds, proceeds. 
I felt you coming here. You're coming here, uh, Nimishram, in Gaia Dream. I've felt this moment. I feel it now. The ritual of Elsing is complete, Waterhand. You are done, and with our thanks. We gained 200 reputation with Chavo, the Tree of Life. 15,000 XP. Wow. Almost enough to level up. Almost. Very close. This quest was almost enough. And I believe we do gain... Um, I think we do, we do gain a, a power source, although I don't know how, to be honest. <clears throat> uh, I have completed the ritual of Elsing. Will you power Barathrum Star Climb, as you said? You have completed the ritual of Elsing. You have set Bright Tau free. Yes, Nimishram, I will turn my chimes spindle word to tune. Then vibrate at our verve frequency. I will power your star climb. Be vested to tell whoever you must that Chava has made this commitment. Thank you. Okay. I will now uh, recoil to Brathroom Study. I just want to see what it looks like. Chava. Chava is our power source. Awesome. Well, that was um, quite a lot, but that was a lot of fun, and it's something I haven't done ever. Um, so it seems like a good place to stop. Um, I just need a little bit more XP, and then I'll have I'll be level thirty-nine. We'll put a point into intelligence, then I will be able to uh, learn and apply uh, Nanon. That'll let us um, dismember things, uh, which is, you know, pretty brutish, but uh, it means we're going to go do some hunting for spare parts. Um, we can acquire parts from any number of things. It could be a, a lot of fun. But uh, we also need to acquire some fluids, and we also need to... Uh, I guess that's the main thing. What, what else? Oh yeah, we also need to find a body. I'm really not sure what kind of body I want still. Um, I might do a little, I, I kind of want a scorpion, but I, again, it's like, it's still, it's it's not gonna have uh, hands. And you know, the thing is, is there's not really a lot of creatures that would have hands. <clears throat> Maybe an ape? I don't know. But in any case, um, I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, uh, maybe hit the like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.